Uh, hello, uh, my name is Konstantinos Tzadzas. I'm a musician from uh, Saloniki, Greece. Uh, besides being a musician, I'm also a musical equipment specialist, which basically means that I take uh, my knowledge of musical equipment and I and apply it to achieve a specific set of sounds. <laughs> um, uh, at the beginning of last year, I started exploring a few ideas uh, around uh, space and sound. And uh, knowing Natasha for quite a long time now, and her being one of my favorite artists, uh, I thought that led to us uh, collaborating and starting this ongoing project, uh, which uh, Distance 2021 is uh, a part of it. This is uh, the first time we actually uh, uh, came up with a final, a first final project of what we're uh, trying to achieve. And we're uh, really happy that um, it, it, uh, being, it being selected. Um, now for the rest, I'm gonna give it over to Natasha so she can uh, Go into detail. Natasha? Hello, I'm Natasha Vapika, and I also come from Thessaloniki in Greece. I'm a visual artist, and my practice range is from sculptures to drawings and videos mostly. Um, I'm very much interested in the topic of uh, space and place, and usually the places um, I am selecting uh, have a strong past, either a historical one or a personal one, personal one, or even better, both. Um, so uh, we, I know Konstantinos, uh, we know each other since a very young age, and um, I really, I really appreciate his uh, creativity, his music, and uh, lately our interest overlap kind of so we are uh, we the, the last uh, year year and a half maybe we are both we were working on the topic of, about a space and place in relation to sound uh, on the basis of the sensorial um, effects and how we can navigate the story and of course the viewers gaze and attention uh, based on this um, aspect. Uh, drawing distance in particular, as Constantino said, is the first project that uh, came to life after a million tryouts and discussions uh, about it. Uh, it is a video series that we prefer to, to, to call it uh, as trailers uh, on the basis that um, we were both examining the the, the state of expectation or even anticipation when uh, you place yourself on uh, in a phase that um, you know what it's coming but you're not quite sure you might be a little bit doubtful uh, about it as it's uh, as 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 the time goes by you realize that the situation is actually completely different than the one that it used to be um, on that basis, repetition is very important for, uh, for us. Um, and to be a little bit more specific, um, in this series, uh, what you um, experience is basically a place that we are both very much familiar with. Uh, we've been there so, so many times already. Uh, we, and regarding uh, traveling uh, there, we also have very specific uh, marks, so to say. So we will know if we're getting closer um, and uh, experience the whole process uh, of it, basically. But what we did was to um, split the route towards that place in uh, three phases. So basically, you see the fragments of uh, these uh, visuals, of this imagery. Um, the voiceover, which is included, of course, um, basically uh, describes the route towards that, uh, that place in a very conventional manner. This is not um, appropriated as a collage, so to say. 
uh, but also in some points, uh, the voice uh, describes these marks. These marks add a sentimental value for us. The voice uh, has uh, the, the volume of the voice is a bit low, and we actually did that because uh, we didn't we wanted to add more value in the sense that how sound can make you come closer, and then what kind of effort and maybe what kind of value you want to give on that, and how you will understand it, and how you will draw mentally this uh, place, again, maybe how you can make it your own. Um, most importantly, as Constantino said, this uh, project is an ongoing project uh, because we're working on the basis of transmedia storytelling. So we are really thinking to expand the, 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 this place, maybe on a booklet format, or who knows, maybe to some kind of um, short experimental uh, film. Um, but uh, right now, uh, the first step is uh, this video series. And we are really happy that uh, you gave time and attention to them and that you appreciated them. Thank you so much for that. Yes, thank you. Um, Corsadina, if you want to add anything. Yeah, thank you very much for selecting and giving attention, as Natasha said. And uh, one thing that we were both uh, talking about was how um, how important it is that uh, what what you're doing uh, how, how you're giving um, uh, keeping um, i'd say it in my words but you're keeping the spark alive and keeping uh, the pot uh, <laughs> going on yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's, it's really important for us how this place will be reformed by you. I really can wait uh, to see the outcome uh, and maybe your comments about that. Um, so this is uh, from us. Uh, please stay safe, take care. And Lacuna Festival, thank you again so much. And thank you again for your creative uh, act especially under these difficult times it's so important what you're doing uh thank you for keeping up the creative vibe yeah. thank you enjoy bye